Myopic Dystopia, the latest release from progressive death metal band Metal Tower out of New Zealand. Let me introduce you to these Kiwi boys first. We have Stevie Sticks on drums, Ho Aivo on guitars and vocals, Chaos also on guitars and vocals, and Madalex on bass. Guys, I get so excited of the talent that's coming out of the metal scene. I feel like I'm just tipping the iceberg here. Um, these guys are no exception. I didn't know of this album. I'd never heard of this album before until the boys threw it at me and asked me to take a listen. And guys, I am so, so glad that you did. This album has properly ruined me the last five days. This album will never get boring for the listener. It's a very interesting ride through several elements of subgenre, including black, death, technical, thrash, Throw in a brooding classical composition with a twist of jazz in that absolutely stunning intro. And if I haven't caught your attention yet, I don't know what will. This album properly smashed me hard in the face. Those heavy, heavy sounds blaring through my headphones very, very loudly. You must listen to this up loud, guys. If you don't, you are properly cheating. This was a pure onslaught of delicious death guitar riffs, percussion that whacked me hard in the guts and deadly black and shrieking and seething vocals as well of course as those deep deep deadly guttural death tones as well it really has it all fuck morning this deadly track that's playing now is definitely one of my picks off this album the vocals go into a more deadly uh, guttural style here with elements of those black and shrieks shining through too which i truly truly enjoyed the guitar work here was so damn technical addictive and brought a very very cool yet extremely hectic melody to this track as well and i really loved the uh, mix up of blast and rhythmic beats as well that you hear very much in death metal these guys nailed it the darkness within this track was very very crushing and very very chunky and those deadly chunky riffs attribute to that this got me. I was a sucker for this track and it was very, very epic in my opinion. Darkness Subconscious. This was a very obscure and extremely intense number going for just around 11 minutes. So you get a full bang for your buck with this track. Those damned in hell black and vocals, they got me every time through, through this album. But the vocal fold, fold skill in this track well, that thoroughly got me, thoroughly got me. I'm getting all tongue-tied, I'm so excited. Uh, the tones created a feeling of lurking and sulking through the darkest voids of the mind. And those low guttural tones when they hit were so, so impressive and very, very imposing on the listener. Myopic Dystopia is heavy, it's very brutal, and it's a complete creation by these boys. Metal Tower have created such progression within this album. Very, very moving, and they've gone in and out of all sorts of things. You can't silo this music, you can't silo this album. Now, if you guys are familiar with their previous album in 2012, Construction Misery, sorry, Constructed Misery, um, you will hear the band's evolution in this album. They've definitely matured throughout their sound, gotten a lot more progressive, and for me, a lot more intense and a lot more heavier. So please go into Bandcamp and check out Myopic Dystopia for yourself. Follow Metal Tower on Facebook and keep up with everything they're doing. To Metal Tower, you guys have properly wrecked me, and I'm so, so happy to know your work now. And thank you very much for the music. I'm Kelly T, and this has been my albums of the week. Bye.